I'm Chris Trott with Team TaylorMade. In front of me, I'm holding the Stealth 2 family of fairway woods. Carbon, that theme, is going to go throughout here. All of these have got carbon crowns. I want to start with the Stealth 2 Plus, and you really have to start there because there's a lot going on. You can see there's a 50 gram sliding weight underneath this golf club. What does that mean for you? Well, you can hit all sorts of different ball flights. If you slide that weight all the way forward, it's gonna be like that Rocket 3 that you used to have. It's gonna come out lower with less spin. If you place it in the middle position, it's gonna play true loft. This is a 15 in standard on the loft sleeve. It's gonna play true to that. And of course, if you move it back, it's gonna be a bit more spinny, which quite often some of us are gonna want that if we have speed. And that's what we're looking for is to try and dial in a ball flight. This is a tight titanium face, so you're going to have that slightly different feel on it. I'm out here quite a long way, this is a par 5 second shot, I'm going to demonstrate just the standard one for you, should look good to you guys as you look against the hill there, just a cruisy 3 wood. You can really see that flight, I mean I love that, and the feel off this golf club is money. Positioned nicely there on a par five, I'd be happy. So if you take the sliding weight, you loosen it up and you move it all the way forward, this is where you're gonna see the big difference. Now I can make the ball flight softer than that and add spin by going all the way back, but moving that sliding weight into the garage that's on the sole there, pushing it all the way forward, same loft as I look down of it, so I've not changed anything to do with the face, but I am gonna change slightly the spin, and this should come out a little bit more rockety for me, a little bit lower with a little bit less spin on it. So you can see there on that ball flight, even though it was hit a little low in the blade, having that sliding weight all the way forward, it never got above the hill there as you're looking at it. It had more knuckle on it. Now, in addition to that, remember, you've got the flight control sleeve as well. So you can adjust face angle, you can adjust loft, which is gonna give you ball flight again that will be down from that. All dialing in the three wood, there's a lot of options here. And also, like I mentioned, sliding weight can go all the way back and loft sleeve can also go towards higher, which again, will add spin and give the perception of a different look. Now, let's get into the Stealth 2. This has a new design V-Seal sole in there. So if the lie isn't great, this is gonna be easier to get out of that. It's also more forgiving because the CG is a bit deeper. It's gonna have a steel face on there. So it's gonna give you a slightly different feel. Carbon crown in there as well. But CG is the different story here. It's also a little bit bigger footprint than that plus. So when you put this one down, it'll come out with a hair more spin for you. Much more of a neutral ball flight potentially much higher ball flight, slightly different sound if you can pick that up, but a great feel from the golf club from there and that V-Steel sole for when the lie is just, I've hit a couple of balls now from the same spot, that V-Steel sole makes it easy to get down into it. There is a third and fourth option. This is newly designed altogether. It's a 200cc Stealth 2 HD high draw model. When you put it down, you're going to see a different footprint comes in there. It's also available in a women's edition where the color's a little bit different, but HD is exactly that, high draw. So if you're someone who loses the fairway wood to the right, or you struggle to get it in the air, turning over, the HD edition of this is gonna be something you should consider. Three woods, you could spend a lot of time working on them and getting dialed in. I'm a big fan of getting a fitting when it comes to this area. The plus for me is something I absolutely want to play around with, but you can see it has me intrigued as a golfer and I want to learn more. I'm sure you do too. If that's the case, go to tailormadegolf.com where you can hear more about the Stealth 2 Fairway Woods.